Sweet. All right. Welcome to Flight Experience, and welcome to the uh, flight deck of the 737-800. Welcome to Sydney, and uh, right there we can see IKEA. Yes. That's how you know we're in Sydney. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, and we've got the international terminal just right there to our left. Yeah. So in a moment after the briefing, we're going to get to taxi onto uh, 16 right, and uh, for, uh, of course, uh, a departure, I would say, to the east-ish, mm -hmm. uh, southeast, and then we'll come back all the way in and uh, we'll do a touch and go and then okay. a full stop later. All right. Which uh, circuit direction are we taking, Jay? That's up to you. Uh, you okay. want to do left or right? Uh, uh -huh. If we want to turn towards the uh, towards the sea or we want to turn inland? Uh, let's go... I feel like right feels more appropriate from 1-6 right. Okay, all right. So we're yep. obstructing 1-6 left. Of course, that's... Ah, I forgot who I was flying with. Yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> that's correct. Um, of course, normally we just give people that option of yep. turn wherever you want to. Um, all right, sweet. So just a quick briefing. I'm just going to run through it as quickly as possible. Uh, yep. Just, of course, so we don't uh, bore you and we can get nope. flying as soon as possible. All right, just right in front of us right there is the, the yoke. Uh, pulling towards yourself, go for it, give it a pull, uh, yeah. quite heavy, and um, nice. pitches up and pushing down, of course, pitches down left yep. and right, of course, you know, turns left and right. Rudder pedals, uh, we'll need that when we're in the runway, we'll need that for taxi, and we're going to need the steering wheel, wheel rather right there um, for taxi and for slow speeds. And once we get going, I'll get you to use that. Yep. Rudder pedals, of course, is to just keep us straight with the runway. And if the screen looks like it's slightly obscured in a weird view, it's just because that's how that this screen is. So okay. you you want to look slightly off to your left or, or correction to your right in a way. Yeah, so if right. you want that line cutting through you, you got to just make sure it's almost cutting through your body, and that's how you know you're on center line. Okay. Yeah. All right. Because uh, nose we, wheel is like back there somewhere, right? So. Yeah. 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 Actually, with this, the nose wheel is not that far. It's quite. It's a 7.3, okay. so it's quite under us. Okay. Compared to, um, I think you would be looking at, uh, what's that aircraft called? An MD-11, I think, where the nose yeah. wheel might as well just be at the tail. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. But yeah, this is kind of just under the pilot's mm. way. Well, like in, um, in Microsoft Flight Sim, they've got the 7.8X, so oh, yeah. the, the stretched 7.8.7. That one's got a nose wheel quite far. The 787 is on the Microsoft sim yeah. now? Yeah, yeah. Oh, man. I've, I've not been on that in, in a the, while. In the deluxe version only. But yeah. Oh, right, right, right. It, that's, it's, the, it's a new one. 787. Oh, yeah, the 787 is there. Of course, I completely yeah. forgot. Um, yeah, I haven't done that for a long time. I haven't had time to go around that. Oh, that's good. All right. So, so far, any questions with that? Yeah. All okay. good. Yeah. All right. Coming to the throttles, and uh, do you know how we know how much power we're putting with with this? How much of? Uh, I'm guessing. That's correct. Yeah. So of course, if you go to one forty percent, yeah, by one forty percent, just looking at that line down there and setting forty, 40 if you want yeah. sixty, that line just keep yeah. it on the six, six. Yeah. And easy. Yeah. All right. Just making sure that that's yeah, is on. engaged. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Sweet. And the reverse thrusters, of course, you know the reverse thrusters are there, so go yep. for it. Yep. Crank it. Yeah, that's okay. it. All the way, and I'll say reverse is green, oh, yeah. and that's it. And then Ooh. we can put that back, back yep. down. Nice. All right. And our flap lever, we're going to need this, of course, for takeoff. So yep. it says that we're going to be setting flaps 5. That's what we've got set in. So you okay. can go ahead and put the flaps to flaps 5. Yep. Down through the gate and up again. Uh, and you five. don't get that on the Bravo throttle quadrant. No, you yeah. don't. <laughs> All right. And of course, coming down to the speed brake and um, just, of course, extra work. Yeah. Uh, when we're coming in for a full stop, you see the dent right there? Yeah. When we're coming to land, I'm going to get you to keep it on the dent. It's going to say speed brake armed. Yeah. And once okay. we land it, to just automatically deploy. Yep. All right. So for now, we'll have it in there but we just yep. remember it's on the dent lift it up keep it on that dent should look there to say yeah, speed brake arm yeah of course go for okay, it okay so that's not armed that's not armed that is armed perfectly Perfect. done oh. okay wow like an expert <laughs> all right all done there coming okay. down here we've got of course our two engines um I would say fuel, basically, yep. like, yeah, so if you need fuel into the engine, of course, we just pull it out of the cutoff zone and just uh, putting that fuel in for the engine to run. And, of course, if we want to cut cut off the engine, we just pull both of them out, but you have to pull them out first and yep. push them down to the um, cutoff position. All right, parking brake, like the parking brake of a car. Um, if you need to disengage that, go yep. for it. You can just, um, yep, push it forward, push it. disengages, oh, yeah. and then you can flick it back up, engages. Oh, okay, pretty, yeah. Yep. Like 
Sweet. All right. Now, coming to slightly something more technical. Um, how much do you know about the trim? Uh, and enough. It, is it set for takeoff? Yeah, so yeah. it's set, um, but yeah. I'm saying that because normally I would do it. I would okay. normally do the trim, but I'm okay. just asking just to give you that, that you know, okay. basically much more work to do. 4.45. Um, yeah, so once we take off, yeah. do you normally in your sim set the trim and let it go, or do you just go on autopilot? Um, I usually would do a bit of hand flying up to a few thousand feet and then put on command day. Okay, so yeah. how, how does the hand flying, do you, do you use a lot of trim when you're hand flying? Um, a little bit, but probably not much in airliners. Okay, and yeah. you do a lot of the Airbus, if I remember. Yeah, so yeah. I'll probably probably, probably use control wheel steering for you then. Okay, um, yeah, because sure. control wheel steering is pretty much what Airbus does. Yeah. Um, unlike Boeing, where you kind of have to manually trim the aircraft yourself. Yeah. Um, so I'll make sure we've got control wheel steering on after takeoff. It's going to engage. It doesn't All engage right. on the ground for Would some reason. Would most Boeing pilots fly with that off? Uh. I would say about 90% or more actually fly with it off because it's off, it's yeah, how okay. it's kind of how Boeing is built. Yeah, you know, right. Air Airbus is just it's already inbuilt, but Boeing yeah. just decided to adapt that system recently. So I think yeah. Boeing pilots still think you know what we'll still trim right. it because it feels right. Let's leave it off then. We'll leave it off. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, are you gonna do the trim or should I'll, I do the trim? I'll do the trim. Uh, so the trim is right here. Actually. Oh, okay. You use right there. You this see one. There? Yep. So push it up or down. You see it moving. Ah, yeah. okay. So, of course, once you pull back and you need to hold it, you first the first thing you do is pull, pull get the yeah. attitude right, yeah. then trim for the attitude. So, okay. yep. so, we just want to make sure no bad habits of trimming before, you know, adjusting. So, you want to yeah, adjust, yeah, set, yeah. then trim. Okay, I'll try. All right, well, we'll you see how... save me. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> I'm definitely here to make life easy for yeah. you. <laughs> All right. So, coming here, the landing gear, once yeah. we take off, call positive rate, yeah. gear up. Yeah. You're going to pull, yeah. so pull it out and all the way up. Yeah, sure. All right. And we're going to set the auto brake to RTO. Um, you know what RTO is? Reject take, take, take off. That's correct. So set that. All right. Yeah. So before we move further, we'll just make sure that everything is set. Just following a flow check. Auto brake, RTO. That's good. Yeah. That's down. Yeah. Flaps five. All right. Okay. That, that looks set for takeoff. Okay. Okay. Can now let's go. Uh... How do I show this arc? Oh, the arc. Oh, so yeah. press press that in. Press in. Yep. Again. There we yeah, go. Yeah, that's what I'm used to. Sweet. That's much better. Yeah. And if you want to zoom in and out, of yeah. course, using that. All right. So that's the nose of the aircraft. Yep. The black dot right there. Once we take off, I'm going to say put that nose at 15 degrees. That's 5. That's 10. That's 15. Moving okay. that nose all the way to 15. Yep. After 1,000 feet. If it gets too much, let me know. I'm okay. just taking you through no, a full briefing. Keep going. All right. After 1,000 feet, the black dot, the nose basically comes down to 10 degrees. Yep. And once we're approaching 3,000 feet, you can put that nose in between 5 degrees or 2.5 or whatever you feel would make us not climb or descend. Okay. All right. Yep. I'll remind you as we get going. All right. We never want to fly in the brown. So at any time where we feel like we're too high, yep. we never want to push that nose down because everyone behind is definitely <laughs> going to leave their seats. Okay, cool. Um, so if it feels like it's unstable, yep. we'll go around. Well, we'll yep. try not to go around. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> All right. Of course, that's a f um, height in feet. Mm -hmm. That's a speed in knots. Mm -hmm. And that's pretty much it for there. Coming over here, the compass... It's like compass rows, uh, you know how that works. Not yep. south, east, and west, showing us which direction we're turning. Sure. Before we turn, I'll try to act more like the ATC sometimes. It right. Just, of course, because it's you with more, slight more experience. So I would say flight experience 290, turn left, heading 155. Yep. First of all, I want you to set the heading yep. before you turn. Ah, set okay. the heading in the direction of your turn. So if yep. I say turn left, yeah, don't turn yeah. it to the right. All yeah, the yeah. way. You want to turn into the left before you before you okay, turn. Okay, sure. All right. Yeah. Okay, we're good to go. Um, I any think questions so. so far? No, I'm good. All right. Yeah. All right. If you have any questions, of course, feel free to ask. Um, if it looks like it's getting hotter in here, please let me know. I'll crank up the aircon. Okay. Okay. All good. All right. Moment. Thanks. Sweet. No worries. Yeah. Okay. Before we go, strobe lights and all the lights should be on. Um, so okay. strobes, position light. Logo. Yeah. Logo as well. Let's Logo would normally be for night, but we can leave that on. Position okay. light, anti-collision, anti light, and wing not needed. Not needed, but you can put it on. Wheel well, not you needed. Can, not needed. So normally okay. this and yeah. that are not needed f because it's daytime. Yeah, right. Um, okay. So they're normally needed for nighttime. Okay. All right. 
uh, taxi lights are already on. Um, normally we wouldn't use that as well. Oh really? Yeah, because it's daytime. We just uh, use like two of that because it's just the two lights on the wings and that's fine. Oh, uh, right, but okay. at night time we can <laughs> I've blast, always just blast like the cranked whole. all the lights. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, at night time we can blast everything on. Yeah, um, okay. At Hong Kong, I'll put Hong Kong at night and you see, you see the <laughs> difference. All right, landing lights goes on since we're coming to the runway. Yeah. Normally it's only this two and we leave that two off. Oh really? Yeah. So, but whatever you feel comfortable Completely is just all the way retractable. So all the way. retractable lights just stay retracted all this, the time. Yeah. So okay. we, we because it's those lights are actually very hot. If you go close to them, it's very hot. So if yeah. we don't need them, we don't use them. That's why once we take off, what pilots do is above ten thousand feet is when those lights come come off. Yeah. But we just put this two off, and then we have those two right. still okay. on because this this is pretty it's pretty hot. That's good to know. Yeah. Yep. All right, so now we're all set and ready. Yep, we are. So the parking brake can come up, the parking brake, push yep. that forward, disengage. All right, and just putting in a bit of power to 30%. Just look in there, so bring that's it. Yep. All right. And we're going to start moving. Now you can crank that up to 40. <laughs> once, once it starts moving, and then you bring it back to 30. Yep. There we go. Moving, yes. Yep. All right, bringing that back to 30. Okay. There we go. And remember, you want that, the taxi line, yep. the solid line just cutting through you. Yeah. Just follow it all the okay. way to the runway. How's the passenger doing at the back? Yeah, pretty good. Good, all right, <laughs> that's good. Not using flight director? Oh, you can put that on. Please, yeah. whatever you want to go, just go for it. Just go for it. Okay. Put it on. <laughs> it's just obviously um, habits with um, having to do things, you know, simpler, where I have everything on on my side and uh, almost okay. nothing on yeah, that yeah. side. Yeah, um, oh. that's all right. Roughly on the center line. All right, and yeah. power to idle. Yeah. Sweet. And do you know where the brakes are on this? All, all the way on top? Ooh. Yeah. Perfect. They're heavy. Yes, very yeah. heavy. Um, just be very careful once we land because we're going to be using auto brakes. If yeah, you okay. if you touch those, the auto brake will disconnect. Yep. Okay. All right. So we're going to let the plane slow down and then after a certain speed, then we can touch okay, the brakes. Sure. All right. All right. Parking brake. Come off. All right. So briefing before we get going. Mm -hmm. In a minute, power to come to will come to forty percent. Yep. I would say stable, mm -hmm. and then we'll go N one. Yep. Just pressing those, the black dot there, yep. the um, auto throttle will take over, yep. and then we just concentrate on keeping the aircraft nice and steady on the, ro on the runway. Yep. Once the aircraft says V1, I'll say rotate, and you just gently start to bring that nose up to 15 mm -hmm. degrees, mm -hmm. and then we'll go from there. Okay. All right. Yeah. Let's get going. Sure. All right. There we go. Flight experience 355. You're cleared for takeoff. All right. Cleared for takeoff. Flight experience 355. 40%. 40%. Stable. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> okay. Do I? Nap, no. So, yep. So normally I would have my hands ah, here just okay. to make sure that's there. Yeah. And then you just got both your hands there. Yeah. And I'll call 80 knots, and you will say checked. Yep. Yeah. 80 knots. Check. Rotate. There we go. <laughs> All right, keep coming to 15 degrees. Yep, yeah. that's it. Positive right, and then. And gear up. You can put the gear up. There we go. Sweet. Yeah. Uh, holding 15. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> How was that? Yeah, it was. Uh <laughs> it didn't respond, so I pulled a bit too much, yep. and then it went whoop. Yep. Yeah. So what normally the trick is we pull it to wait, wait to see what it does. Then we yeah, go from okay. there, one thousand feet, and the the nose comes okay. to ten degrees, because now we've reached like the acceleration. I know to be gentle now. Huh? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Yeah. All yep. right. 
All right, okay. so set the speed to 230 here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. And normally after you do it, you, you say 230 set. 230 set. That's it. All right, R looking at your speed right there, yeah. we've just passed uh, yeah, flap one, flap one. Yeah. All right, flaps one. There you go. There we go. Yeah. All right, so once we come out of the seven nautical mile ring, because there's a seven nautical mile ring, that's yeah. 10. Once we come out of it, we will start making a right turn. Okay. All right, 3,000 feet, the nose can come down to five. Okay. Oh, slightly below it. Yeah. So, of course, just referencing the vertical speed there and see what it's doing so we yeah, know whether sure. we're climbing or descending. Ooh. All right, looking at the flap speed as well. Yeah, we're full, well, yeah. fully. That's it, oh. lift, and all the way forward. There okay. we go. Yeah. Sweet. All right. And how was that? Yeah, it was good. Good? Yeah, everything happens quickly, right? <laughs> it happens, that's why yeah, there's yeah. always two people. And you have, like, muscle memory from a simulator on a computer, which is quite different when you've got that's very controls correct. ahead of that's you. That's very correct. That's very correct. Yep. Yep, normally <laughs> that would be on. We didn't do chrono. <laughs> we never do chrono. Yeah. <laughs> um. Yeah, that's why normally, of course, um, in a situation where it's like a proper leg, you know, yeah. you go through the whole proper procedures. But once we start on the runway, even we start picking up little habits here and there. Yeah, sure. All right, flight experience uh, 355, make a right turn heading 335. All right, right turn heading 335. Three, three, That's it. And now we start the turn, looking for a 30 degrees angle of bank. You know what a 30 degrees angle of bank is? Yeah. Yep, yeah, that's it. All the way around. Keep that turn Keep going. going. There we go. There we go. Roughly. That's it. <laughs> oh, we're losing uh, speed. Yep. Losing, uh, uh, every turn you do will always yeah. require pull back. Um, a pullback. That's it. Very well done. Quickly as well. Yep. All right, neutral on the turn, because we're going past 80 degrees, that's oh, yeah. it. There we go. Wow. All right. There we go. That's it. So normally what happens is yeah. if you see you're dropping below 3,000 feet, mm. you will call the height that you are. You'll be like 2,500 correct in. Okay. So, which means I can see and I know that you know you're dropping. Yeah. So that's what would normally happen. Okay. Okay. Three, three, five. That's it. So how, when do you start rolling out? Now you can like start rolling. Out? So, yep. So you see yeah. that tail? Use that tail as your guide. So start rolling uh, out. Start okay, rolling okay, okay. out. There we go. That's it. Nice. Oh, uh, too much. <laughs> <laughs> uh... That's it. Now we're going too high. There we go. All right. When you're ready, I can go into an Airbus mode. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> there we go. I think poor passengers are getting thrown around a bit. But it's all good. All right. So we need to get stable so we can yeah. do the um, after takeoff checks. All right. I'm trying. <laughs> uh, there we go. That's it. 332, that's close. So we're at 3,500. I'm working on the direction first. Uh, that's good, go. that's good. There we go, there we go. Okay, 335. The trick is you can use that as well, so you can have one thing on the screen. Ah, uh, okay, that's all it. on the PFD, yeah. Yes. Okay, and uh, <laughs> 3,100 and correcting down to 3,000. Very good, very, very good. Okay, there we All go. All right. Okay, I'm going to engage yeah. the control wheel steering, and um, when you're ready for the after takeoff checks. All right. All right. Go for it. Looking at your yoke. Yeah. All right. So, after takeoff uh, checks, after engine, take engine, engine bleed. bleeds on. So you have to look at it first to make sure it's on. 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 Yeah. Packs. Auto. That's correct. Yeah. Uh, landing gear. Up, and Up. it should be here. Yep, pull. And off. There we go. Up and off. Yep. Okay, flaps. Up. 
No lights. You look here as well. Oh, okay. Up, up and no lights. No lights, yeah. And then after takeoff checks complete. After takeoff checks. One more thing, auto brake comes to off. Okay. There we go. All right. So now we're yeah. downwind. Yeah. Quick briefing. Once we get a beam, the triangle being the aircraft gets a beam the yeah. threshold, we'll start descending to 2,000 feet. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll basically just look in to join. If you look at mine here, we're just looking to just join the top of descent right there okay. for a final, um, the, f the final approach yeah, pretty sure. much. Yeah. At 2,000 feet, not yeah. below 2,000 feet. All right. All right. And on that descent to 2,000 feet, we'll slow down to 200 knots. 200 knots, okay. Well, I'll remind you once we get there. Yeah. All right. Do you want to start descending now? or? Um, at your discretion. <laughs> All right. I'll wait. I'll wait a little bit more. Okay. We being thrown around behind, how's the passenger <laughs> feeling? Bumpy flight? Pretty good. <laughs> it's, uh, it's weird. Oh. That you see it's moving, yep. but you don't feel that uh, it's moving. I know. <laughs> well, uh, I'm getting a bit sick. Uh, is sick, it? Yeah. Yep, yep, I, I know what you mean. That's like my brain's ticking. Yeah. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> it's all right. You can keep yourself busy looking down because sometimes yeah, it does happen. Yeah. Descending 2000. That's it. Flight experience uh, 355. A slow down to 200 knots. 200 knots. Flight experience 355. There we go. All right, and not in the brown, just the above brown. the horizon would yeah. do. That's it. Perfect. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, it, it would drop really hard if you're in the brown, right? Yep, it would. It would. And uh, I mean, except it's an emergency, we normally yeah. don't, don't, of course, fly, yeah. uh, fly in the brown. Because it's going to be very uncomfortable for even the passengers as well. Yeah. So I didn't know that before I started flying. I didn't know. I yeah. always thought, ah, the brown, we're descending. Yeah. But I didn't know, like... You know, just keeping it above the horizon, mm -hmm. the plane descends anyways. Alright. Hmm. I'll just call, um, keep our um, call sign short. Flight experience uh, 35, turn right heading 070. Right heading 070. Correct. Flight experience, experience 35. In flight experience, uh, cool. three five slow down one eight zero knots. One eight zero knots flight yeah. experience three five. Now, yeah, the mistake we have done just of course just a heads up with a Boeing with Boeing oh. planes. Yeah, you see as that's below that yeah. yellow line. Yeah, so we shouldn't be below that line. So yeah, if the yeah. ATC says slow down first. You come to the flaps. Ah, so okay. bring the flaps to five. There we go. Down and up to five. Yeah. Sweet. That's it. That's five. Yep. So I'll just increase this to 200 knots. Yeah. Just. Okay. Yeah. We don't, yep. want, don't want to stall. Yep. That's correct. Yeah. All right. Flight experience uh, three five. Keep turn uh, to heading one five five. Keep turning heading one, one five five. Right. Flight experience three five. three five. And watching the height. And the turn, uh, uh, uh. neutral on the turn. <laughs> a lot is happening, I know. Yeah. Now, yep, that's it. Jeez. Flight down. experience, 3-5, slow down to 1-7-0 knots. 1-7-0 knots, flight experience, 3-5. Flight experience, 3-5, uh, do you have the runway in sight? Uh, runway in sight, but we're very high. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Flight experience uh, 351, stable, uh, runway 16 right, clear to land. Stable, runway 16 right, clear to land. Flight experience 35. All right, sweet. So now we're too high, and yeah. we know that we need to descend quickly. Gear, yeah. gear can come down. Gear the gear, can. gear down. Yeah. Sweet. All right, and just, yep, that's it. All right. And now we're going to need flaps 15, so yep, slow down. So we'll wait for it to slow down to 170. Yeah. Speed brakes. Up and all the yeah. way. That's Speed it. Speed brakes. <laughs> no, oh. Normally, Ooh. this does not happen. This goes straight on the report. <laughs> if you yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> really. Well, we did kind of cut it short. That Yeah, uh, we did. We did. You're yeah. very correct. We did. 
and I was very bad on altitude management. <laughs> nah, yeah, that's yeah. alright. I, I just decided to put a lot more on you. Yeah. It's alright. Alright, our speed is dropping. Alright, flap 15. Flaps 15. That's it. Set. That's it, coming to the right. Alright, bringing the speed down to 150. 150 knots set. Uh, yep, and bringing it up, bring it up. Yeah, yeah. Two whites, two, two reds. Red. Perfect. And holding, all right. And holding. Speed brake can go up. Speed brake. All oh. the way, all, all the way. way. Yeah, because it's a touch and go. That's oh, okay. it. Okay. All right, speed below 175, flaps 30. Flaps 30. That's it. There we go. Coming up, glide slope. That's it. Glide slope. Correcting. There we go. That's it. There we go. Four reds. That's it. Yeah. H holding that attitude. That's it. Just holding that attitude. And there we go. Perfect. All right. All right. Right hand on the power. Yeah. All right. Remember, you want the center line cutting through you. Yeah. And just very tiny movements. Uh, there we go. Sit. And no rudder input. Oh, yep, that's ready. it. Okay. Yep. Idle. All right. Bring the power back. Power idle. And just hold. Yep. Just oh. hold. 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 That's it. Hold. There we go. Perfect. Ooh. All right. Just a slammer. There we go. All <laughs> right. P full power. All right. Toga. There we go. And now rudder input. Oh, okay. There we go. Back to center line. Perfect. Oh, I'm enjoying this flight. Rotate. There Rotate. we go. Holding oh. very gent. That's it. Positive rate. Positive rate. Gear up. Gear up. All right. So pull the gear all the way. Does a pilot do that? I do that normally. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yep. All right. Back to 15 degrees. Because in Hong Kong, or actually, sorry, in New Zealand, yeah. we will probably be running into a mountain if we don't climb yeah, at 15 yeah. degrees. All right. Arming the auto throttle. Auto throttle. Um. There we go. Speed to 230. Speed 230. That's it. There we go. Okay. All right. Flaps one. Flaps one. All right. Set altitude 3000. Altitude three. Perfect. How do you feel? Good. <laughs> That's good. Is that a butter? Like, no. I, that, that, that. <laughs> <laughs> honestly, that that was for me, and I kid you not, honestly, that was the best landing without my input. I have uh, not touched uh, the okay. controls <laughs> at all. Okay, cool. So that was all you. Thank you. 3,000 yeah. all the way to 5, just below 5 degrees. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Yeah. Very well done. All right. Yeah. Okay. Flaps up. Flaps. All the way. And Where down. To down. down. Up. Oh, okay. Yeah, pretty tricky, so isn't weird, it? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Airbus is like. Tick, tick, yeah. You know, I think they lifted. I'm not they really. Li lifted they lifted not, a bit. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We're there we go. Coming down to 3,000. All right. So we're making left or right turn. Uh, let's do a left turn this time. All right. Flat experience. 3-5. Turn left heading 3-3-5. Three, three, left heading 3-3-5. Three, three, flat experience 3-5. That's it. Okay, this needs to be three, three, five, and we'll start turning and start That's it. pulling back. There we go. That's it. Yeah. Neutral. Beautiful. Well, that was good. Ooh. I feel very relieved. Being an instructor and not doing anything is the yeah. most beautiful <laughs> flight ever. <laughs> That's good to hear. Uh, I, I really enjoyed yeah. that. That was good. Mm. Um, so, yeah, with the, um, uh, I was going to say, because we came on the landing and on the rudders, with yeah. this big aircraft, yeah. you don't really want to be touching the rudders in flight because just a oh, really? tiny movement will swing it off. You okay. Try putting in the rudder and see, see what happens. Just go for it. Hey, yeah, it's yeah, yeah. imagine passengers what they're feeling yeah, at yeah. that moment. Exact small planes, very yeah. small planes don't care, but big planes because it's a very big tail. Mm. Yeah, so you come when you're coming down, even in crosswind, even yeah. in crosswind landing, it's all aileron movements, and only in that last moment, yeah. just about to touch down, just do they just allow? Yeah, do yeah. they just swing it a bit? You know. Yeah. Okay. 
But yeah, there's not much rudder rudder input because um, the yaw dampers. That's technically the yaw mm. dampers um, job. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right. So looking at the center tank, I can see we're actually running out of fuel on the center tank. That's so <laughs> but we have enough fuel on the left and right uh, tanks, yeah. so we can uh, put the uh, fuel pumps off on the center tank. So yeah. pull, so pull. Ah. Yeah, and pull. pull there That's well. it. Yeah. A lot of security features on this yeah. aircraft with the landing gear. Almost everything you does, you have yeah, to yeah, make a pull. Yeah, you can't just knock it. You gotta. That's yeah. yep. Exactly. All right. There we go. All right. Let's step things up a bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bit high as well. All right. Okay, uh, flight experience uh, three five. Uh, caution: uh, uh, thunderstorms in the area, uh, okay. so you might have a bad uh, bad weather approach. Copy that. Sweet. All right. So we might have to rely on the ILS when mm -hmm. coming down. Okay. So with this one, we've already yeah. got the um, ILS set in. Yeah, so 109 yeah. and 1095. If you want to confirm, you can yeah. go to uh, go to init ref. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, actually, let's clear that first. Yeah. So in index, so actually. So index right there. Uh, there we go. Um, approach. Approach. Uh, so you can confirm right there. Yeah, 109 one one decimal 5, 155 on the course. That's it. Confirm. Yep, and 155 set. Yep. On the course, that's it. All right, so just pretty much as an Airbus, once you set the <laughs> attitude and and leave it, yeah, it it would just trim it out for you. Interesting. Funny enough, I didn't I didn't know about that. Uh, I didn't know the Airbus did that until what last year, I think. Yeah. Uh, when a mate of mine just suddenly had this love for Airbuses, and we started reading up on it, and I was like, oh wow, there's a lot of things uh, on the Airbus that is amazing. Yeah, it feels quite different with this on compared to where the off yeah yeah yeah, yeah. like so. with that turn i just sort of set it and then ha and then left it yeah and it stayed it, whereas exactly. in the first turn it just kept winding Good. down without pulling <laughs> it, back yep, yeah exactly that's correct all right is there a push to talk on the yoke is um there, yes I mean, there, so yeah there is it's actually behind here so is the trigger yeah, so it's down. Yeah. I think it should be on your left side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah there is. I was just one. I've never held a yoke, so I was. Oh yeah, you said you said that. One. Yep. Yeah, there actually is. All right. So same as before. Um, flight yeah. experience uh, three five descent to two thousand feet. Descend two thousand feet. Flight yeah, experience three five. There we go, and then we start that descent. Yeah. So now we're gonna actually try and come in from Erden. Erden. Okay. Yeah, just to give ourselves enough room. Because it's an eyeless approach. There we go. That's it. Cool, can't right. see anything. Yep, so now on this descent, let's start preparing ourselves. We yeah. want to do it early. Yeah. So, first of all, slow down to 200. Zero zero. Zero zero knots. There we go. Alright, flaps comes to 5. All the way to five. Flaps five. All right, and once we get to five, yeah, then we can set flaps five speed, as you can see on the PFD in green where it says okay. five. Yeah, yep. yeah. That's it. Yeah, it's much better to be ahead of the plane. Exactly, that's correct. All right, so since we're doing a full stop, we want auto brake two. Auto brake two. Yep. Click it a bit. Turn it to the right to click. There we go. Uh, and set your speed brake to armed. On. So bring that down a bit to the dent, roll it down, down, down to the dent. There we go, perfect. All right, approaching 2,000 feet. Yeah, 2,000 feet. There we go. All right, flat experience, uh, 3-5, turn left, heading 240. Heading 240, flat experience, 3-5. Okay. All right. I'm gonna wait. That's all right. Seconds. That's okay. That's all right. <laughs> Completely in charge, Captain. That's it. Okay. You're doing the right thing. All right. Your gear should actually come to off. off. We should have done that. Yeah. We, yep. That's it. We didn't do that here, did we? Yes, we did not. <laughs> all right. Setting flaps five speed. Okay, flaps five speed. There we go. Is what 170? I think so. Yeah, it should be yeah, about 1702. 
Perfect. Let's start the turn. Yes, let's start the turn. There we go. Yeah. Low, glide, slow. There we go. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. All right. Still needs to pull back a bit. Yep. Yeah, flight experience 3-5. Uh, if you can, when able, continue turn 2, heading 155. When able, continue turn, heading 155, flight experience 3-5. So when able basically gives you the chance to almost yeah. saying, yeah, do what you want. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. There we go. Try and straighten it up a bit here. Yep. Try to try and intercept okay. the ILS. Very correct. Yeah, and just using that tail to guide you. So we're close, so you can start turning uh, left. Okay. Yeah, so using that tail in front. There oh, we yeah. go. Yep. yep, that's it. And while watching your bank angle at the same time. So you see as the tail has gone too much out, so you bring it back in. Yeah, bring it back in. Yeah, that's, that's it. Don't descend too much. That's it. Bring it back in. Try and get onto that. Okay. Yeah, there we go. That's it. Pretty much here. Yep, that's correct. And don't be tempted to look outside. Once I see the runway, I'll let you know. Because you right. can get disoriented if you look outside. Ah, uh, because of the clouds? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, approach. That's it. It's good. It'll do it now, right? Yep. yep. All right, localizer alive. That's it. And we've missed Ooh. it again, so keep that turn going, because we've got your localizer going to the left, yeah. so keep that turn going. Yeah, there we go. Oh, so it doesn't grab it itself. No, no. Oh, because you put the approach on? Yeah. Uh, so the autopilot's not on. Ah, uh -huh, so okay. You, so, so uh, ah, I was waiting for it to <laughs> grab it. Nah, okay. So the autopilot's not on, so it's still manual flying. I'm still so flying it down the Yeah, so you're doing the whole manual uh, ILS approach. Okay, All now right. I know what I'm doing. Yep. So, yeah. <laughs> so make that, that right turn, yeah, yeah. start that correction. There we go. That's all good. And once the glide slope is alive and captured, then we'll put the gear down. Okay. All right. There we go. Localizer alive. Localizer and is captured, more or less. Affirmed. All right, coming to the right. That's it. Glide slope alive. Glide slope's alive. All right, so you might want to zoom in more if you can. That's it. Oh, yeah. That's it, yeah. And coming to the left, 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 yeah. that's it. <laughs> yep. So you want solid, purple to a line, yeah. and that's it. Okay. All right. All Waiting right. for the glide slope. Mm -hmm. there we go. All right. That's it, and now okay. very tiny movements, glide slope, captured. Glide slope captured. Gear down. Gear down. Flap 15. Flaps 15. Set. All right. All right, from here on, I'll take care of the flaps. Okay, thank you. No worries. <laughs> All right, and just following the glide slope and the localizer, pretty much. Yeah. All right, and just very tiny corrections, mm. as tiny as possible. Scary, man. <laughs> <laughs> The stakes yeah. aren't as high when you're just doing it on the <laughs> screen on your computer at home. Um, you're doing a good job, man. You're doing a good job. <laughs> All right, just following the glide slope. Yeah. It's above us. Then we'll just wait for it to come back down. That's it. Beautiful. Stable. That's it. Glide slope is below us, falling it down just a tad tiny bit. Here we go. And the localizer is slightly to the left. That's it. Very tiny. Yeah, very, yeah that's correct. Very good. <laughs> now it's that's the right. It. That's it. Very tiny movements now. That's it. Uh. And that's it. To the left and <laughs> spade. That's it. Set. And now we're getting closer. The glide club gets sensitive, so more tiny movements. Okay. That's it. Well, what's the minimums here? We've got to be close. <laughs> yeah, we're close. Coming to the left. Yeah, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
There we go. Oh, well, it's way left. Let's see. Ah. 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 That's all right. That's all right. Pull, 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 pull. pull. There, hold, 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 hold. Hold, 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 hold. That's it. Coming to the left. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Reverse. Reverse. Reverse is green. And See speed so. brake deployed. There we go. 80 knots. And at 60 knots, we'll bring that off. Okay. And 60 knots, 60 knots off manual braking. Off manual braking. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Jesus, that, that runway came in at like 250 feet. <laughs> well done. <man. laughs>